My name is Sam, and this is another drag race. Let's roll! We finally managed to get a CT4 Blackwing on the channel. Now, for some people, this a bit, might be a little bit disappointing because it is a six-speed manual transmission. For me, I've had it for a week. I don't think so. I think this is the most fun you can have with a car, in my opinion. It's one of the best transmissions, I think, in my opinion, in terms of six-speed manual. The Tremec on this thing is absolutely gorgeous. But what I thought would be good, a Supra, versus a black wing and a Z versus a black wing. And that's what we're gonna do today. So the first race we're gonna do is the CT4 black wing against the Nissan Z. Then the next race we're gonna do is the Supra versus the CT4 V black wing. And why are we going this way? Well, simply because I'm trying to be as safe as possible. Also, I think it's a lot more fun when it's a two car race there's less mistakes, and at the same time, you can see the potential of one car. And the idea today is mostly the CT4 versus the world kind of thing, although we don't have many options. Uh, I was told this was gonna be a 10 speed, and I actually had an M3 automatic competition for the race, and then when I went to pick it up, it showed up as a six speed manual, which again, I'm not disappointed because I absolutely love this car. This is spec'd out really bad in my opinion. Um, the seats are not the bucket seats. It doesn't have any carbon fiber on the outside, but it has the most important things. Like uh, the interior has like uh, heated seats, for example, we have a beautiful digital cluster and so on. It's still comfortable, still really good. But first race we're gonna do is against the Nissan Z. We're gonna start with the roll races and then we'll go into the drag race so that we can get those tires warmed up. The Z is running, of course, the famous Bridgestone. I have Michelin on the sides. This is a rear-wheel drive, that's rear-wheel drive. Uh, that over there is, uses a three liter uh, V6 twin turbocharger. Of course, we know that makes about 400 horsepower and about 350 uh, pound-feet of torque. And on this side, we got uh, the V6 twin turbo as well in here. This makes under 500 horsepower, about 472 or so. It's a six-speed manual transmission with no lift shift. And this has, in case if it rains, which I don't think it will, uh, I do have a wet traction. This is really amazing with this little switches on the steering wheel. It's the most superb thing. Uh, but the difference is that this does make more horsepower, but it's also heavier in comparison to the Z, but then it has better tires on that end. Anyhow, we're still gonna find out how it compares against the Z first, and then we'll do the Supra, which is also a six-speed manual transmission. So in this case, let's start first with the roll race and then the dig. Let's roll. Perfect, right there. Okay, Dave, we're gonna do first the roll race. I'm gonna put mine in V mode. I have V mode over here. And we're gonna do traction for race. Okay, I got all the goodies on this side. What mode are you driving in, sir? I'm in sport mode, traction on. Fair enough, okay, so. First, we're gonna do first gear, second gear, stay right beside me all the way to the cones over there. And then after the cone, you know the drill. You ready, sir? Yeah, I'm ready. When I say one, two, three, go, and go, we roll. One, two, three, go.
no, 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 no. You kidding me? No. Okay, something happened there. That was crazy. No, that's not possible. I think you might have jumped a little bit, but let's try it one more time. Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, one, two, three, go. close now we're talking okay there's nothing else I can do about it. Like this guy, it's just going on me. Okay, when the hands are down, we go. Um, I am ready on this side. Okay, this is gonna be interesting. Problem is that if I do a very, if, if I do a very hard launch, I will spin like crazy. Yeah, I got him. I got him, but not by much. Not by much. I was spinning too. Man, this six speed manual in this car, it's absolutely superb. This six speed manual in this car, it's just. Man, you weren't far at all. Like maybe half a car? I'm sure I had a wheel hop myself as well. Um, should we do it one more time or uh, Jim, are you happy with the launch? Did we go at the same time or are we okay? Okay, now we're gonna do the Supra, which I don't think I'm gonna have a chance, but I just wanna see how much further or faster that Supra is. So, Dave, keep going forward. Let's do the roll race first. This is crazy. Um, keep going, keep going. Perfect, right there. Um, I do have a weight disadvantage uh, on both cars, whether it's the Z or the Supra, I'm heavier than you guys because this is a sedan. Anyhow, we're gonna do roll race first. So, 
you have a sport button in that car in the middle. It says right in the center console, and then that's all you need to do. That's all that thing has. You have driven it before many times, so first, second gear all the way to the cones. You ready, sir? Yeah, ready. Okay, let's get smoked. Uh, one, two, three, go. Not far. Not far at all. Not far at all. Not far. He took it, but not far. I might have him from a dig, or he might be closer from a dig. That's crazy. That was not bad. I expected you to be more than a car, but you were like maybe half a car. Let's do it one more time. Okay, you know what? Let's do this at a higher speed. You okay with that? We just gotta launch, we just gotta launch a little bit faster and that's it. Okay, one, two, three, go. just going wow that was very interesting like i wasn't far away from you but still like so so quick that supra just keeps going eh okay we're gonna do one from a dig That's what I'm talking about. I think uh, if we keep doing this all day, the result is gonna be very much the same. That Supra hooks so well. This does too, but it's also heavier in comparison. Even though I make more horsepower, uh, it's heavier. But it's just, I just wanted to see how good this thing is. I'm a bit disappointed in the fact that this was not a 10 speed because it would have been a lot closer with uh, manu automatics. But even with manuals, we can all agree it's a lot more fun. Dave, thank you so much for helping, buddy. So yeah, that was it. We just wanted to do them separately because there's less chance of a mistake from a driver. That way you guys can really enjoy the difference. And I wanted to do the Z first because on paper against the Supra it's slower, so that goes first. Um, but it just, you know, this gives you a great idea how things work in terms of the manual transmission, how these cars compare. And funny enough, like this is actually very close to the price of the Supra, but you can carry four people in here, four or five people at least. Uh, the Supra, you can barely get two in there. I'm always claustrophobic in that car, but that car is so freaking good in terms of traction management, in terms of how it launches, tire management as well. Six-speed manual, it's good. It's not great, but it's good. The eight-speed, in my opinion, is a lot better. Anyways, that was it, guys. Uh, this was the car that I almost bought, but in a 10 speed. I'm gonna do a full review. Or maybe I already posted it. You should check it out. Cheers.